Good day everyone, welcome once again to my YouTube channel, Great Check. And once again, this is Jerry. And uh, in this video, I'm gonna share to you how to kick off your Wi Fi users. They are not authorized to use your Wi Fi, they know the password of your Wi Fi, and that's why they can connect to your Wi Fi anytime. So that would be a big problem because if you have so many Wi-Fi users connected to your Wi-Fi. The problem if uh, everybody knows your Wi-Fi password, they can connect to your Wi-Fi anytime they want to. And uh, it really slows down your bandwidth and your internet. The hackers also can be in control of your router, internet network, and even you. And your friends also can download any illegal torrents and the bandwidth exceeding FUI limits resulting in plan upgrade and if you ask the people to stop using your Wi-Fi you just have to ask them to not to use your Wi-Fi anymore but nobody listens to your request and that is the big problem and the most popular way to remove users from your Wi-Fi network is by changing the Wi-Fi password of your router but then this will disconnect all the other connected devices including your phone and your laptop so it's not only the other people could be disconnected but you too all your connected device your laptops your cell phones or whatever can also be disconnected if you don't want to go through the pain of re-entering the new password on all connected devices again here is the solution to your problem what you should do is you just have to download a free app um, I just want to share to you the one that I just found out how to disconnect devices from my network through this um, free app called NetCut I just have to show to you how and what um, and what free app which is really helpful to your problem so here in this website rkarchai.com slash download netcut so this is netcut you just have to uh, choose which one the, the latest one is netcut 3.0 it supports Windows 7 Windows 8 and Windows 10 and if you just want the previous version like uh, if you have Windows 7 64-bit so it um, you have to just use NetCut 2.1.4 version but for me I just have to uh, encourage you to just download this NetCut 3.0 and uh, you just have to right click that one and then you have this uh, file downloaded to your computer then after that all right and it's done so just uh, open the file open the file and then you have the okay Right, sorry for that and then it's here open the file and then we have the this one here so here you have this um, installation wizard and you just have to follow the instruction and then if you're done uh, reading then just click install and after installing actually after this we have you have another file also that you need to have which is uh, also linked to this application so the the application the next application will be the supporting uh, application and uh, and then you just have to eh, oh, like this one okay so this is the second application win cap win cap 
4.1.3 and then just uh, follow the instruction and this will be supported this will be supporting to your net cut and then next then I agree and uh, and then install okay, just follow the instruction and after that if you're done with the instruction with that if you're done with the installation especially um, I have done with this so what you will do is you can you will just have to cancel this one cancel this and uh, sorry for that but uh, because I've done um, installing this uh, application so I just have to find my my downloaded I uh, know I just uh, I just have to find the application that um, this is what you will see after the installation but since I'm done with this I just have to close this up close this it was minimized but I just have to close it and uh, I have this net cut in my desktop net cut application then I have to double click this one and then I will be brought to this uh, part of um, this tab of my web browser and then this is what you will see you will find on your screen when you click when you double click that uh, they did the net cut application on your desktop and then here you will find many devices connected to your Wi-Fi and this part here this is my Wi-Fi um, like uh, this is the Tenda the brand of my uh, Wi-Fi so and this is also mine and I have this one also connected to my Wi-Fi and I have this one too and this one so if I want to disconnect any of this I just have to example I have this part here this one so if I want to disconnect this one the person that is connected to my the, per, uh, the, the, the device that is connected to my Wi-Fi will be disconnected after I drag this to the last part no, yeah, I just have to this one uh, do this one close okay so if you see this one here the the this connected device is moved to this policing one this column here which was before it was here and um, if you see here there was still 38 bandwidth MB first per second so if I want to have this I can control this device through this uh, very powerful application so um, I can do this close sometimes it uh, like uh, like this one okay sorry for that because it's a uh, wait until okay so to set new speed limit so um what is uh what happened here is that the first time I um, set the Mbps the bandwidth of this device since from the unlimited part of the supply of the signal so I just could um, control it into like this middle here so 38 Mbps uh, so megabits MB yeah Mbps so I have this one here since uh, I want to have this one here until the last part I can control this device as what I told you and um, but because I already have um, controlled this one I already have set this one to this bandwidth so what happened is I have to wait for 74 seconds to set new speed limit for this device so uh, so you can do this you can have this one you can control any of this but be sure that you know which ones is yours because if you don't know that one and then you disconnect it you might be wondering why you are not connected you cannot connect to the Wi-Fi anymore so you just be careful to uh, choose which one 
and if you see here there is unlimited like this one here unlimited um, like this one here unlimited um, bandwidth and um, so I can also choose this one if I do I want to to any even just to the last one kbps so you can make that one and uh, this is trusted users since uh, I'm the one who um, do the like I what I'm an admin so I made this um, I have this part here and uh, this is my the admin part of this um, the, the the display of this uh, free app uh, netcut so try this one and you will see that it also really will help you to your problem so bye everyone hopefully that uh, you have um, learned through this video and uh, this would hope hopefully this would also help you to um, you know, have a little stress on um, your problem with your Wi-Fi so bye everyone thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe have a nice day